Part 12, Linear Inequalities. You will find this on page 118 in the Namibia Mathematics Grade 9 textbook, Y equals MX plus C to success. Linear Inequalities. Smaller and equal, bigger and equal, smaller and bigger. This is what is inequalities. Okay, let's just go through this diagram. So if you look from this side, so the small side is looking at you. So it's smaller. Can you see? She's smaller, she's bigger. So less than. But if you are looking from this side, then you can see that this is greater than this. So she is bigger than this. The same. So if you are looking from this side, the big mouth is looking at you, so it's bigger. But if you are looking from this side, it's less than or smaller. Okay. Illustrate all the inequalities and identify the integers in that range. Okay. So if I give you a, a diagram like this, can you see it's not colored in? So X is smaller than 3. Okay. So X is less than 3. Um, you can either write it like this or you can write it like this. If I give you this one, it's also not colored in, but A is bigger than 5. A is bigger than 5. Or you can write it like this also. A is bigger than 5. Then you read it from this side. Okay. What does it, if it's just integers, it can be like 6, 7, 8, if I'm just talking about integers. Okay. If I give you this one, so can you see it's colored in, and can you see it's going to this side? So y is smaller and equal to 8. Or if I read it from this side, y is smaller and equal to 8. So it can be 8, 7, 6, 5, if I'm just talking about the integers. And if I'm reading it from this side, b is bigger and equal than negative 2. Can you see the equal? Then, then I will always color in that circle. So, um, or b is bigger and equal than negative 2. So it will be negative 2, negative 1, 0, and 1. Okay. I want you to do the following. Try now 19. Do number A as well as number B. Um, I think as well as number, let's just see that it's the opposite, as well as number C. Do that three sums. You can stop the video, and as soon as you are finished, you can continue with the video. Okay, let's start. Try now 19. So illustrate the inequality and identify the integers. So if I look at number A, number A is x is smaller than 5. So if I have a number line, there's my number line. Then, okay, let's just put a few things on. Oh, let's just undo that. Put it there, okay. So if, if, say for example, this will be, let's just make this 5. 5, then this will be 6. Oh, it's a little bit close. We'd rather use 1 centimeter blocks. 7. Uh, we could have actually, the next one I will do that. Um, so this one is negative 4, negative 3. So if it's smaller than 5, then I make it like this. And now I use again this. And I use again this. And I do not color in because it's not an equal sign. Okay, let's see if we can have a grid. Oh, oh, well, let's make uh, one like this. Okay. So the next one will be number C. So if I have a number line, there's my number line. Let's just write it down. So A is bigger than two and a half. So if I do this, say, for example, this is one, this is two, this is three, this is four, five. 6, 7, 8, and it's going on. So A is bigger than 2.5. So there is 2.5. It's exactly in the middle there. Okay, so let's just make this circle. And we don't color it in. It's exactly in the middle there. And then bigger, so we're just going to make a line. 
and we're just going to do this. Okay. And then the last one is number D. B is bigger and equal to negative 1. Okay, so let's just say, um, if just this is my number line, let's just make this um, negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. Okay, so it's bigger than negative 1, and there's an equal sign, and then I color it in. And if it's bigger, then I'm just making an arrow to this side. And there I illustrate it on the number line. Okay, let's go on. Let's go to the next one. Just want to move it up a little bit. So list the integer values of x for which, and then they give you this is integers, so it's just whole positive and negative numbers, and illustrate it on the number line. So it must be bigger than negative 1, so you are reading it from the middle. Can I just illustrate it by this? So you're reading it to this side, and you're reading it to this side. So x is bigger than equal to negative 1, and x is smaller than 3. So bigger than equal to negative 1, so that's an equal sign. So it's negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. It's not colored in because there's not an equal sign. It's not included. And there is the solution. Okay. Uh, let's just go to the next page. I want you to do the following for me. Do for me number... Let's just mark it. Do number A as well as number C. Okay. So list of, um, into, you can stop the video, and as soon as you are finished, you can continue with the video. Okay, so list the integer values of y and illustrate the following inequalities on a number line. So basically, let's start with the first one, which is going to make it again a grid, so it's going to be easier. Okay, so if I'm going to list this on the number line, so let's just first write it down. So it's y is bigger than 2 and smaller than 8. So there is my number line. Okay, there is my number line. Okay, and then let's write it on the number line. So let's make this 1. So this is 2, 3, ooh, 4, 5, 6, 7, oh, it's just going to be a little bit close, 8. Okay, so if it's bigger than 2, so it will be that, uh, and then it will be this included, okay, and then all of them, it's just integers, so that's why it's not the values in between, but this one is open again. Okay, and so y can be, let's just write it down, y can be 3, 4, 5, Six, seven. Uh, two and eight will not be included. Okay, and then if we look at number C, y is bigger and equal to negative two and smaller than three. Um, so if I'm having a number line again, let's just make the number line. Um, I'm going to make it a little bit longer. Now, if I write it in this, okay, let's just start here. So, this is negative 3. This is negative 2. Negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Oh, you, that, that, you, why is 3 so slow? Let's clean that one. Okay, I think this will be enough. So, bigger than equal to negative 2, so I color it in. Then it's negative 1, then it's 0, 1, 2, um, this is all colored in, but 3 is again open. Okay, so if I must write down the values of y, then it can be negative 2, it can be negative 1, 0, 1, 2, but it will not include 3. Okay.